I've worked with uh, Steve Lipia many times. I think this is my fifth or sixth time, and it is a joy to to play with him. Uh, he uh, not only a great singer, but his arrangements are fantastic. Um, the use of the orchestra with the big band uh, it it's just makes it as American as it can be. How nice a day you can be. In addition to that, his voice, uh, he, he, as he will tell you at the concert, he doesn't try to imitate uh, Frank Sinatra at all. It's just that he just sounds like him. And that is just so uncanny and uh, so uh, unique. Uh, he's a wonderful stage presence and he's a really nice guy. So all of those elements, uh, you know, are exciting to me and uh, uh, prompt me to tell you that it's this is going to be something really special. Never can win. Use your mentality. Wake up to reality. I grew up in Mexico, in a little town, uh, where American music was played. Um, my father grew up uh, playing. Uh, the big band uh, music, and I was familiar with uh, uh, Tommy Dorsey, uh, with Glenn Miller, with uh, Harry James, with uh, Billy Mays, and of course the music of Frank Sinatra. So ever, ever since I was a little boy in an obscure little town in Mexico, I knew about Frank Sinatra. That's why his music and uh, how he became the American icon uh, icon that he is, um, well all of that uh, influenced me and uh, that's why I'm so familiar with his music and I'm a great admirer of his artistry and he's truly, truly unique uh, in the history of music and the development of the big band sound and how he was part of that uh, became of course uh, an American phenomenon so uh, that's why uh, you know, I love this music. The music of Frank Sinatra is unforgettable, uh, and in fact, anybody can recognize that. And uh, some of the themes that uh, I was playing, well, everybody knows them, and uh, I think you're going to have a great time. I'll see you there. Yeah.